Hey all, Russ here, RVTV. Good morning. Today is Thursday, January 24th. I'm down here on Central, and this is Main Street. I'm going to head south. We're going to make a quick run out to Roadrunner BLM Land and the Quartz Fest. It's a ham radio group. A bunch of RVers that have ham radios and do a quick run through there. Okay, we are crossing over Interstate 10 here and on the right is Tyson Wells and what a great day yesterday. My goodness. 100, over 100 people showed up. Over 20 states. Unbelievable. What a great time and thanks for everyone for attending. I know, I was exhausted, <laughs> but what a good time. We'll do that again next season. Okay, right up here on the right. You see all the motorhomes? That's where I did the video about the RV show, right there. That's where I walked through. See the flags? That's where I started, right in there. The big tents off to the right. All right, let's head on out here. There is a sea of RVs on both sides of the road. To the right is La Posa West. To the left is La Posa North, and they are packed. And I mean packed full of RVs. And right here, coming up, is the other two. To the right is Tyson Wash long term and on the left is the famous La Posa South and I think on the way back after we uh, go film up here let's uh, take a run and see how them dumpsters look let's see if they've been cleaning up after themselves I've been hearing various stories so hey we're out this way when I get done out here at Roadrunner let's uh, stop on our way back we'll check it out and see for ourselves Okay, we're getting close to La Paz Road, but we're going to turn before that, uh, I was told, the little dirt road, it's exit 99, or not exit, my goodness, I can't think, mile marker, 99, right there, okay, we're going to make it right here, there's a little dirt road, this is all road runner, just a little side entrance off the main highway, about another quarter mile up is uh, La Paz Road. And that takes you up there and look at all the RVs with antennas. My goodness. <laughs> they are broadcasting out here, man. Wow. I did a video about Roadrunner. It's part of the series of videos I did a couple months ago about all the free camping around the Quartzsite area. Roadrunner is one of them. To me, I kind of like this one. It's farther out. I like the ones that are a little farther out. Look at that van there on the left. It had a little antenna. Everybody's got a ham radio out here. Talk all the way around the world. I think it's really cool. I've been asked to join. Just something I just haven't had enough time yet. Look at that big antenna on the back of that motor. Oh, my goodness. I'll fly the drone. We'll do a drive through and then I'll fly the drone. The Quartz Fest and a lot of these groups, uh, they support a lot of different things in their own communities and Quartzite. They get a lot of kids involved in ham radio around here too. Okay, over on the left, they got speakers set up. That's where they have their meetings. Fire pit going, still smoldering. They must have some nice fires at night. This is a good group. I mean, I've talked to a lot of these guys out here. And it's always good. What a great place to set up, too. Look at the antennas. Look at them all with the flags. <laughs> Talk to the moon out here. They can really go. 
and they're having a four wheel event this morning. They're all going to go four wheel, and that's what all these guys are lined up for. I heard about this yesterday at the meet and greet. I'm not going to stay out here too long. I'm just going to do a drive around. We'll fly the drone and got to head back to town. They got flags flying right off their antennas. Isn't that cool? They even got antennas on their cars. Look at that. Handheld. Got the kayaks on his Jeep. They're ready to go. Wonder where they're going. There's a lot of other groups. There's groups actually everywhere in all these uh, BLM areas. Newmar, some guys told me yesterday at the meet and greet about uh, they got 500 Newmar coaches out here. I think they're over at La Posa South. Maybe next season I'll try to post more of the groups that are active out here. And it's roughly around 8 o'clock, low after 8 in the morning. Chilly night. It was in the high 30s. Supposed to get up close to 70, but we're supposed to be in the 70s all weekend. Tents on the left. That's our sign up. They got an activity board there. Really cool group. If you ever get into ham radios or just want to learn about them, this is the place to do it. All right, I'm gonna go back out by the highway and get that sun behind me, and then we'll fly the drone real quick. See what they look like from the air. The winds finally calmed down. We had a couple days this week of some really high gusting winds. All right, it's drone time. Up we go. Get over top of that power line. Look at them all. This whole section here is their Quartz Fest. This is the 2019 Quartz Fest. How cool is that? They got a lot of people here. Hundreds. Hundreds and hundreds. Look how green the shrubs are in the wash from the rains. And yeah, we'll swing around. There's Highway 95. That's looking back towards Quartzite. Keep on going. Down, right down there, that's La Posa South. But what a lot of RVs. This goes through Saturday, I think. The 20-something. <laughs> I don't have a calendar in front of me. But you can see them. Look at them. They're still lined up. Waiting to go on their four-wheeler. Looking good. Then way out, that's uh, La Paz. Those uh, RV parks out there in La Paz. And off to the left up there, that's where the host is. That's where he sets up up there. There's La Paz Road right there. And there's a good look at Roadrunner BLM Land. Big old semi right there too. Okay, let's get landed and then we're going to head down the road. Let's go check out La Paz South. Well, let's get back on the road here. That was a great look at the 2019 Quartz Fest. A lot of traffic. People heading north and south, but mainly south. I bet they're all heading down to Yuma now, winding down from the show. Last day of the Big Tent is Sunday, and they actually close it at 3 o'clock. The vendors tear down quick, too.
All right, this is we're gonna make it right here into La Posa South. And that camera's gonna get right in the sun about right now. <laughs> Oops, sorry about that. Well, I'll hurry up and get up. We're just gonna check, see what looks like up around the dumpsters and get, get out of here. I'm not gonna fly the drone. We'll just make a quick drive through. They still have the closed signs on the office. Everything looks pretty normal, but what a ton of RVs. Look at all the dust in the air. My goodness, that makes it hard to breathe. Look at this guy kicking it up. But it's a desert. You get dust in the desert, nothing you can do about it. Just go slow. Here's the line to use the dump. And they are lined up. It's getting close to 9 o'clock now. Big old schoolie right there on the right. Still got a solar up, so he just must be emptying his tanks. There's another schoolie. Alrighty, and there's the dumpsters on the left, and I do not, I repeat, do not see a big mess here. Thank goodness. Let me get flipped around up here. Well, what a good thing. My goodness. Now, the big, looks like the big roll-off is still full. Check it out. There's nothing on the ground. Today is January 24th. Close to 9 o'clock in the morning. What a relief. Look at that. No mess. Thank goodness. I know they get full and it gets busy. and But once again, the transfer station will accept trash in town for free. They're open Sundays through Wednesdays. I know it's not seven days, but it's better than nothing. If you have problems with any type of trash or anything like that, contact the Chamber of Commerce in Quartzsite. I'll put a link to them down in the description. All right, nice weather means I'll be out filming. I'll be back at Tyson tomorrow, filming around the showgrounds there. I'm gonna try to uh, sneak in Desert Gardens too. All right, this is Russ signing off now. Hope everyone has a great day. Don't forget to travel safe. Talk soon. Take care.